I mean slayers. So if you cannot tell from the title of this video, we are going to be talking and examining um, my opinion and my two cents on the James Charles topic. Um, I wasn't going to do this and then I realized that I need to gain subscribers. So let me get involved in this drama and tell you guys my opinion on it. Maybe comment down below your opinion so we can be on the same page. Because boy, this drama is juicy. It got really juicy when like Shane Dawson unfollowed him. That was when I was like, sis, I'm joining the bandwagon. One, subscribe if you're new and give it a big thumbs up if you are going to boycott James Charles with everybody else until he gets his act right. So that's the first topic I wanna talk about. I wanna go ahead and say that what James did, I mean, he, but he didn't harm anybody like physically. But for James to do this to Tati is insane. It's not like some random person this was basically like his mom. And if you're gonna sit here and betray your own mother, shame on you, tisk, tisk, tisk. Canceled, sister. If you guys don't know about the drama, basically Tati, James's pretty much mother figure, um, she was there, basically put him on, gave him all the clout that he has. Okay, she didn't give all the clout, but you know, she was there and she, and she deserved a little bit more respect. Basically, James was talking crazy behind her back and also really backstabbed her by promoting her competitor and then kind of lying about it, trying to um, make it seem like he, you know, he had no other option. Well, not to mention the things he did to Tati was really bad, but he's also been trying to manipulate straight men um, using his fame, his money, his clout um, to manipulate them into maybe thinking that they um, are bisexual or that they're interested in men. And that is really wrong, okay? Like the whole Tati thing is pretty wrong in my opinion. Um, but at the end of the day, like listen, I I'm gonna be a little bit um, ratchet and say it. You know, Sister James was just trying to get that that coin, but also at the at the cost of a friendship, actually like a motherhood. So that was a no go. He really sold out for, let's say maybe a hundred thousand. But I mean, he makes millions and millions off of these palettes alone. Not to mention the amount that he probably makes on YouTube. So for him to completely backstab somebody for an amount of money that's kind of pocket change to him is pretty like wrong. Like it's not right. You know, basically I don't hate him, but I will, I am going to cancel him. I unsubscribed. I was part of the 2 million people that did until he gets his act together, you know, give it some time, see where he goes from this. See if he grows, see if he becomes a better person, see if he stops going after straight males. Um, and we'll go from there but you know i've seen people do a lot worse things on the internet so i'm not going to sit here and like hold this over his head too much but i'm not a james charles fan currently um i guess i kind of was to begin with because he was really a forefront i kind of look up to him in a way but a lot of the things that he did it just makes him seem so like caught up in the money and the fame and he's willing to 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 do anybody wrong so Besides him making money and being a big influencer, it's like his own best friends couldn't even trust him. So I don't know. I hope Sister James gets it together. I hope he goes to a sister psychiatrist or you know sister counseling and hopefully gets that sister solved because that is a big issue. And obviously the money, the fame, Ellen is somewhat getting to his head. I'm not really sure. James, I bought this palette you know, with intentions to help you out in your career, to support you, to, to be there for you. And what's crazy is I had your back. I had your back, we all did. And you didn't even have basically your mother's back, the biggest influence. So you kind of backstabbed her. So I think it's time I get you back. And to be honest, James, no low blow. I wish, I hope I can be on the level of success that you are at. I hope to be there one day and by being loyal and respectful to the people who paved the way for me, which is no one. I owe no one my success, but you do. And you backstab the only person that you should not have. And for that, unsubscribe. I really don't want to make a mess. So I'm just going to hit this once because 
I do kind of like the yellow shade, so I'm going to try to avoid it. But I'm going to hit this because I'm mad and I'm really pissed at what you did to Tati. And until you apologize correctly and not none of that mumbo jumbo, sorry guys, I've been, I've been flying abroad. I've been living the life. I'm a millionaire. Sorry, Tati, for doing that to you. Uh, on to the next one. He act like that video was just going to blow over. Like, in another, I, sister, like, don't make a, a response video in the first hour. Like, give it some time, James. Like, you really uploaded that as fast as you could to try to stop losing subscribers. Like, you didn't even put no thought. You didn't write any notes down. That was not from the heart. You could tell it was just so fake. You know, you're good at makeup, but you're not good at acting. <laughs> okay, and that's, that's the facts. I notice now that this beauty community is all crazy and discombobulated. So Sarah is gonna come into this thing and wreck it. I'm gonna start studying, doing my makeup research, and I will have a superior brand here in this. So James, I'll be here when you get your act together, but for now, you are sister solo. tripod up destroying this thing but like I said I do like the yellow shade this is also good for James because I think it finally gives him a taste of reality that you're not untouchable James and that you can't be doing this to humans and your friends so I think it's a good learning lesson for him now he might come back gain more subscribers and be more successful later down the road and I hope all the best for him but until that we can see that he's changed I don't want to support him I don't want to be a part of his journey anymore I wish you all the best, but I will not be using this palette anymore. Maybe just the yellow shade, but the rest of it, no, I'm not going to use it. Anyway, I'll see you guys every single Sunday for another Sarah Slade's video. Sorry, I've been slacking on content. I just moved into my parents' garage. Yes, I tried to lie and say I bought a mansion. I did not buy a mansion. I moved back to home with my parents because I got into some sister scandals and I went broke, but I'm going to come back. And love you ladies, love you slayers, and remember, it's not what you pay, it's how you slay.